Hello. Well, Hubert de Givenchy will be probably most remembered for his association with Audrey Hepburn and um, Jackie Kennedy, whom he met when she was herself a young fashion journalist, Jacqueline Bouvier in Paris, um, for his very beautiful and feminine design. And um, these designs were shown at uh, most recently in Calais at an exhibition where his deeply modern aesthetic could be seen, starting with his very first Bettina blouse, all the way through his high-profile friendships. But also, he'll be remembered as a couturier that was most interested in the fabrics. He would very often visit uh, factories to keep abreast of development and see what the latest fabrics were and how to utilize the beautiful textile heritage that he had as, at his disposal. And uh, Monsieur de Givenchy was also a very humble person who always said that if he could, um, if he could work volumes, it was because Cristobal Balenciaga had paved the way. If he could drape as well as he did, it was because Mrs. Madame Gray had paved the way. And he was such a gentle, beautiful, creative soul. So he'll be very sorely missed. And Givenchy, of course, is a lot more than clothes. Uh, it's a, an empire with perfume and makeup as well. Indeed it is. And that has all grown. But it's, it's all started with that initial idea of offering women a complete wardrobe. And I think that was part of his vision as well and developed. And those perfumes were launched very, very, sorry. Uh, those perfumes were launched quite uh, quite an advance for their time.